me fucking don't put it in stereo. Stereo killed the friendship star. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back to Chin Strap and Stereo Chat Stumps. All right, Bill, you got a question for me now? Yeah, I got, a, I got a fucking question for oh you. Oh, my God. <laughs> no, I disagree. Oh. And here's why. You see, the Chinese <laughs> and the way in which that they handle... Okay, whatever. <laughs> All right, my question is... How do you how do you like uh, drinking your drinks? Do you like it out of a can? Do you like it out of a you know like what what do you think is the best you know the best way to drink your your salty beverage? That's, that's tough. That's a tough one because um, it really I mean it kind of depends on the beverage sort of and. Uh, I don't know, man. Because a lot of the stuff, I mean, I, I drink a lot of, you know, stuff out of, like, plastic bottles. Like the uh, Mountain Dew, obviously. Uh, water bottles. Things of that nature. I don't know, man. I think it depends on the drink. Because I think, like, depending upon what kind of drink you're drinking, it'll be in a different, you know, uh, cup. Or mm -hmm. whatever. So, like, if you're drinking like a monster, like that's going to be in a in a can, typically. All right. I think well, here, let me let me narrow it down. I was having this epiphany with Pepsi, PP. Okay. So normally at work, all of the uh, all of the cans of Pep or all the Pepsi is in bottles, plastic yeah. bottles. Yeah. Which you know are good. Nothing wrong with them. Uh -huh. I definitely do prefer having like a a can yeah. over a bottle. Uh huh. But then I took my Pepsi Pepsi and I had actually poured it into my thermos cup uh -huh. that had ice on it. Yeah. And when I drank it, that shit tasted like a uh, fucking uh, 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 what you call it, a uh, fountain. Okay, I can and see I'm that. Just like, I think I think I'm with you on that actually. Like now that you like are kind of describing it a bit, but I never buy cans. I only ever get the bottles. Yeah, like that's the thing. It's like I bought, I bought the bottle one, full. You know, I'm like, oh, I'll just put it in my thermos, and I'll keep it cold and it's on ice. And then, like I did one of those like high pours. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And, uh, yeah. yeah. That's, that's high-class stuff. That's yeah. why you're doing it that way. And fucking, yeah, it comes out, and I'm just like, shit. This shit tastes like fucking... I think, I think like part a of fountain. It, I think part of it, too, is just that, like... Like I aerated it or something. <laughs> I think part of it is that, uh, like, the, the metal containers, like, keep it cooler, too. Yeah. I think that's kind of the thing because I have a metal furnace, uh, thermos, not furnace. <laughs> I have a metal thermos that I use um, for, for uh, like I take water with me on um, when I deliver mail. Yeah. And usually I'll put, you know, like in the summer months anyway, I'll put like some ice in there and I'll just fill it up with some water. Um, and it keeps it cold pretty much all day because um, that's what it's obviously designed to do. But like. I think I'm there with you. Like, there's something kind of like a little bit more refreshing, like out of like a can, especially if it's been refrigerated or cooled or chilled. You know? Yeah. Because yeah, the the plastic bottles don't uh, they don't hold that that temperature as as much. So yeah, for me, it, it definitely I like the thermos. Like, if that's the thing, I'm I'm gonna be just doing now. Yeah. Whenever I feel like drinking a pop, though I don't drink pop much anymore now. Again, uh -huh. I'm back on the uh, just drink water shit again. And smear them. God damn it! I'm like just standing right in front of everybody to get shot. <laughs> I'm coming to. I'll save you. Oh, I already died. Oh, I'll <laughs> save you. I'll save your corpse. Yeah, I'll save your corpse. Doesn't get. Because the only way, because the only way they make this game challenging is to stun you when you get shot at. Yeah. If it weren't for that, then you would never die. 
I think that's a good argument. I think that's a good argument to, to be made because some people like will say they don't like it like a like a can because of the like the metallic taste of certain things. Yeah, I don't know. Which if I kind of get it. I kind of get it too, but I might. But I mean, my thermos is you know, it's got it's, it's right here. It's a plastic thing that you're drinking out of technically, but like the thermos itself is metal. That's cheating. Got it. Oh my god. The explosions in this game are pretty good. Yeah. I, like them. I, I missed the explosion. You know, they, they've been kind of doing like these these remakes lately. With Remake the, this. You know, the, uh, the, the Risen and Evils and shit like that. Yeah, I think on the new Resident Evil engine, like a new Lost Planet game could be kind of cool, maybe? Yeah, I'd, I'd play it. I would. Like, I'd be interested. Like, I don't know if there's enough of a fan base to warrant them piling the resources into that, but I don't know. I know we've gone over it like several thousand times, but like I think there's there's a lot of cool shit in the game. It's just a matter of kind of like realizing the gameplay a bit better. That's really the only problem. Yeah. Because I like this idea. There's like these weird these weird offshoot like Capcom games. And they're not even. I mean, I guess I don't know if Lost Planet necessarily is an offshoot game in a sense, but it's not popular. And I guess that's what I mean. But like. Um, like even with like like Dragon's Dogma, I see like a lot of similarities between the two games because there's like big monsters and stuff, and they kind of have like all these like you know weird like quirky things about each of them, like the VSs and this, and then like the different classes and pawns and shit. And yeah. Like, you know, Dragon's Dogma. I'm pretty sure they're gonna be making another Dragon's Dogma. I think. Yeah, I believe. I. I think there was news on that. I think the um, oh, I think the director for uh, Devil May Cry Five had said that like like they had ideas on the table for Dragon's Dogma Two, but they wanted to do Dra uh, Devil May Cry first. Yeah, and then I really haven't heard much. I haven't heard much either. From the, the Duke Mayor. There's um there's the uh, there was the online game for Dragon's Dogma, but that was in Japan only. I think. People love it over there, which makes sense because it seems like a very Japanese game anyway. Yeah. I remember this map. Oh my god. I can't believe you've done this. Cooked the last of fucking eggs, bitch! <laughs> Why isn't that guy playable in this? <laughs> the cook some eggs, bitch, man. <laughs> the cook some bitch eggs. What? You know. Whoopsie. Look, that was eggs, bitch. That was. I remember Derek. We looked that up at, at uh, the pizzeria, and then he looked. He tried to find like the context of that video, and he, he says that like I guess the the lady on it was was a real like chef or something, and that she like lost a finger in like an accident or something. Oh my! Which is terrible. I mean. At least I guess it's just a finger, but like that's yeah, that's but a shitty time. You know, if you're, I mean, if you're anybody, that sucks. But like, yeah. you know, she's especially like she's a chef or a cook. Like you kind of need those. Yeah, when you cook some eggs, bitch. That's why, that's why whenever I am cutting stuff at at work, I always am very careful because I need my fingers for fingering things. Yes. You don't want to be like an alien, man. You can't play your songs no more. Yeah, I would be devastated. I would be so upset. Like, I would, like, lose an element of my life <laughs> if I ever lost a finger or, like, damaged my fingers in some way. Look at this cut I got on my finger. <laughs> That's been happening to me a little bit. I've been getting cuts on my hands a lot somehow. Why are you, why are you fucking up your hands, bitch? I don't know. Because it's a crazy year, and I figure I'd try something new. <laughs> yeah, like cut my fingers like off. Like cut my fingers off. Oh. Did he just say, I'm going to do fromage? <laughs> I'm going to do fromage. Oh, there's I a love shield Dexter. in here. Dexter. When's the last time you've seen Dexter's Laboratory? God, man, I don't fucking know. <laughs> you, can't, you can't even quantify that, huh? Yeah, no. <laughs> That's how I feel. I'm like, I have, like, I don't know. I'm sure there are still some people that actively watch that shit like all, all the time but I'm like I have not seen it in like a good I don't know 15 years probably longer than that yeah probably longer than that 
Alright, this, um, this mech is fucked. I'm done. Yes. What do we got in here? We got I think I think maybe we just games. suck at this game. Do you think we suck? I mean, we're getting through it, but we're like bumbling our way through it. You know, I feel really unchallenged right now, though. Okay. Like, I feel pretty good. Uh, just keep, nah, nah, just nah, keep nah, getting nah. shot up. <laughs> Yeah. Where the fuck even are you? You're like over there. Yeah, well, you know, someone's gonna give a shit. Alright, hey. Rude. Did I need a rocket launcher you? Yes. Is, is... Well, I'm fighting mechs over here, dude. Yeah, no, I'm, I was fighting mechs. But now I'm fighting people because I'm out of mechs. Because you don't fight mechs when you're out of a mech, Taylor. Well, I'm a man. I would always fight the mechs in the multiplayer without a mech. Oh yeah, it's easier actually, because you can just fucking move. The game would have been totally unbalanced if you could hijack them like you could in like fucking Halo or something. <laughs> More like Galo. I remember that was a cool feature back then. It's like, oh my god, it's like Grand Theft Auto. <laughs> That's what everybody would say. They're like, oh my god, it's Grand Theft Halo. Go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Is that other one dead? Did he, did we get, you got no. that one. No. No, he's he jumped over the thing. Oh. I gotta. Oh. I gotta go. Billy, the fart series is over. Yeah, I just. Yeah, well, up. I still got a fart. Oh. Life is oh, a highway, no. Taylor. <laughs> and I, and I'm one in my way. I'm gonna fart on it all night long. <laughs> all night long. <laughs> I feel like this whole encounter has been all you, man. You, you're gonna get the better grade here, because I was just bumbling around, fucking doing a poor job. You know what I like to do at work? Spread your cheeks and lift your sack. <laughs> <laughs> when some when some people like say uh, like what you just said, bumbling See, around. Cooperation is key, and I'm not cooperating. <laughs> <laughs> like uh, bumbling around or something like that. Yeah. I'll just be standing there. I'd be like, yeah, you know, I'm just bumbling around at the speed of sound. I got places to go. You know, I gotta follow that rainbow. And then people would just be like, nobody, does nobody get it? Yeah. <laughs> Except for like two people. <laughs> and the one girl, she's like, I really want to sing that right now, now. Are you, were you ever like, can you feel the sunshine? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Do you, like, want, do you want this or do you want me to get it? Uh, yeah. Or right, who's coming down here? Hold on. You know who's coming. So yeah, I'll start seeing that shit to uh, <laughs> just at work randomly. I think yeah. that's great. And yeah, people, people, most people don't understand. Some people do understand. and They hate it. Well, you gotta teach and these, these culturalist swine what is right in the world. You know. Yeah, like my. Uh, my one old boss, he is 65. Okay. And. Yeah, he'd be like, what the fuck? <laughs> like, it'll be a nice day out, and I'll be like. Can you feel the sunshine? Yeah, I'll be like, yeah, can't, can't you feel the sunshine? I don't know what the lyric after that. I can't remember too right now. I'm forgetting. Something um, like about your day or something. Can't you feel the sunshine? It just brightens up your day. I think it is. <laughs> but yeah, so basically I do that. Uh, and he's just like, yeah, yeah, I get that. And then Ashley, the girl, <laughs> will just be like <laughs> sitting there and be like, She'll be like, I want to sing it. <laughs> I want to sing the song. <laughs> get him, get him, Taylor. I can't get him. I don't have any grenades. Just fight him. I am. I'm shooting right at him. All right, can't you well, see? I can fight him. You see, I that's know. what I needed is with your grenade. Well, maybe, you know, use the v VTOL. What? What? There's the joint one. We got to do the, the 420 joint one over here. Yeah. Remember that one? Yeah. <laughs> we get a we get a, some trophies for that or whatever. Yeah, get out of the way. I'm trying to take out this other VS here. There he goes. <clears throat> Find a multi CV. Yeah, it's over here. Two and two. I think it's this one. 
No, maybe not. It's one of them. It's over here somewhere. Yeah. Oh, here. Do you have? You don't have a, a secondary weapon here. Hold on. Hold on. Ooh, there's a sniper rifle. I want that. But also, I can't pick that up. I can't pick both up here. Where are you at? Right here. Can you get down? Yeah. Hold on. Yeah, shoot some dudes. Get down. Here, I'll attach this for you. There you go. Enjoy. Oh, yeah. Thank Pumped you, up bye -bye. kicks. Thank you, bye-bye. Where is that other one? There's supposed to be another one. Oh, there it is. It's down there. Yeah, yeah that's right. We'll, we'll grab that. I wonder if there's any of the other weapons that are on it or that need to be taken off of it. So we can use that shotgun on there. See, that's cool. I like that type of shit. I think that's neat. That's teamwork. It well, makes the dream work. But I mean, like, not only that, but also just like this, like, this is a cool thing right here. But also, like, being able to take the weapons on and off, I think that's really interesting. Oh, I need you in it to fire the turrets. I can't fire the turrets on this. I'm coming. I have to fuck this guy in my ass. Oh, and it can hover. Fuck yeah, dude. Oh. Uh, oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> you fucking do it. Yeah, well, let me fucking eject. Alright, I'm back. Back? Back in black. Hit my sack. Footloose. I love, I love back, dude. Footloose. <laughs> Romanoose. Rum ham? <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's about right. Here, you have to get in. Oh. Get in. I'm doing it. Oh no! <laughs> that didn't really work. They shot a rocket right at us. Nope, now they're dead. Watch out for that rocket launcher. You're gonna be shooting. There we go. See, I like that. You can shoot their projectiles out of the air. I think that's pretty cool. I'm not. I'm not mopping though. See, the first time we did this, we were getting, like, gold medals up the ass, and now we're getting, like, silver, bronze. Well, you know, we can't always be top-notch. Oh, my God! <laughs> uh, <laughs> that poor man! <laughs> <laughs> he just went flying. Turn the Swiss <laughs> uh, So what are we doing in all this? Like, uh, like do we know what we're doing? We're, We're just assaulting the, uh, the jungle pirates. Jungle pirate people. Because we don't like their dreads. Was that the whole point, though? And then they run away like Gears of War. No, um, remember we got, like, attacked by the, uh, Acrid. And mm. we landed in their territory. And now we're trying to leave their territory. Oh. To get to wherever the fuck we're going. Burger. Probably space station. No, it was Burger King. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I Burger King. No. How did I get a fucking ass in there? Salty ass. Ugh. Well, I don't know how I got an S. That doesn't make any sense. Probably because I died. So? That's why I didn't get an S. You, you got so many more kills than I did. Yeah, but like, I died. And that one death is too many. Oh, this is where the giant salamander is. Yeah. I think. Pretty sure. Do this one. Hell yeah, see if you have actual, like a whole group of people and then you get fucking three people in one VS, it's pretty dope. Yeah. It's pretty dope. I think I might be able to activate this one remotely, let me try. You might not have to even get out. Oh, oh, never mind. Okay, I guess I do have to get out. Some of them, if you hold down the stick and then tap the button, it'll activate the post so you don't have to get out. Yeah. Which is another really nice thing. Yeah. Well, next time on Chin Strap Chat, just because we're running long on this episode, we're gonna go ahead and fight the salamander. And we're gonna fuck this guy. Where's he at? Where's he at? Uh, he hasn't uh, done the thing yet. Oh, uh, he should be. Well, we'll see him when we get back. <laughs>